Yeah, Orange Insomnia 2005, it's basically something unique and new for Botswana, which is combining the hip hop culture, the upcoming hip hop, hip -hop culture. And the house culture. For a long time, Botswana was exposed to uh, South African Kwaito, bubblegum, and uh, you know South African jazz. And recently, you know, most probably because people have been traveling more, or students have been going overseas, and so on, uh, there is now an interest for hip hop, and there's an interest for house music. So we decided to bring uh, the best of hip hop and the best of house. So for the hip hop part, we chose the uh, group called Squatter Camp, uh, some award winner in South Africa, which. You know, it's sort of like a crossover between hip hop and, and Kwaito, but obviously more on the hip hop side. Then we had local artists, Ka, Ignition, and Oracle. Let me hear you say no! Yeah. 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 UK to get three uh, well known DJs. Well, one is Kinetic P, and he's actually Mutsuana, who's now doing a lot of work in the UK. Uh, as a DJ, as a promoter, and, I, and he actually managed to hook me up with two very good international DJs from France, Yaz and uh, DJ Fudge from Travel Men. We managed to get all of that, you know, getting the hip hop, getting the, the house uh, uh, together, the house music DJs together, including obviously the local DJs, Owen, uh, Duke, O'Neill, uh, and Sunlight, the winner of the Orange Pin Doctors. We managed to, you know, get them to share a stage. The purpose of uh, my visit in Botswana is to share uh, my experience, to bring uh, our knowledge, if we have knowledge, uh, of the music and uh, of the DJing and the producing. I remember the first time I, I went in a club, uh, the music for me was not enough good, you know, so I decided if, I, if I'm go to DJing, it's better because I'm gonna, I'm gonna play my own music, so I want to hear the music that I like. Uh, me and my brother were collecting um, audio tapes, and uh, the fact that I liked music so much, I just needed to share with people um, what I feel inside. When I was young, you know, I was 13, and I, I've seen some guys on the TV doing some things with vinyl, so what are they doing? So I tried to do the same, scratching and mixing some things, and I bought turntables, and it caught me up. It caught me like a, like a drug, you know, and it's a, it's a lifestyle now. For me, a good DJ is someone uh, who can read the crowd, someone who can uh, who, who have a good selection uh, someone who, who can uh, make the fire on the dance floor you know DJ is uh, a way to, to transport my soul and my feeling about in music through the culture of clubbing and Turntables and it's a kind of expression. I think what makes a good DJ is um, a DJ that really knows his style and that knows where he stands and doesn't copy anybody else's style. A good DJ, uh, first, I think he plays for uh, for people. He should be himself and, uh, and, and be sincere and make his best to do the best selection for the people. It's communication between the people and, and him. 